Hello gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm, Fairy Vixen here, back again with another video. I want to thank everybody for showing up for the auction today. Uh, I will be washing the jewelry tonight. And hopefully packing up as much as possible tomorrow. Um, so that everything is ready to go when the invoices come in. I do need... Uh, Hello, Miss Scarlet. Okay, well, she just blew whatever I was saying right out of my head. Um. Mm, 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 what the heck was I saying? I haven't a clue. It was about somebody needing to send me their info, and I can't remember who. Uh, yeah. So there's that. <laughs> um, yeah, we have more of this. There's another white one. Stretchy, stretchy. Milky, milky. Uh, plastic. And we have another one in blue. Scarlet says hello. Or I should say, uh, Scarlet Shrieks Hello. How's that? Here is a white, plain white bangle. Ding, dang, ding. Bing, bang, bong. And it's quite filthy. Yeah. It'll clean up, though. You need white to go with your summer outfit. Here's a little plastic ring with paint. Is that paint or is that in it? I think it's in it. In it. In it. Here's a nice, ooh, a nice potato pearl and dyed howlite and gold tone stretchy cross bracelet. That's a pretty one. That's one of those ones you can wear ten of them up your arm. Here is a stretchy faux pearl. Not quite as nice as the other one. Here is a stretchy, oh, oh, that's a shame. See, they're, it's uh, missing the paint on most of them. But the metal elements are still good, so that's going to go in the, you know, the craft lot. The craft lot. I haven't sold any craft lots. I haven't been pushing them. Hold on a second. Let me bring in a box. Let me go with the dead box. This is the box with the things in it. Craft lot. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight craft lots. So, oh, I wish you would hush up. Um, in their uh, small flat, right? But flat flat rate boxes, except for the last one is a gallon bag, the um, small flat rates I'm going to let go for 20 plus shipping, and I'm not really sure about the gallon bag, how much I want for that yet, probably 40 plus shipping. <sighs> This one is hand done and it's very dabby. Needs to be restrung. Some faux pearls, golden pearls, with some little plastic guys. So that's going in crafty crafties too. It's nice for the beads. Here's a little purple. Little purple guy. Look at him. He's very sparkly. And he's on one of these Shambhala bracelets that is uh, tied wrong. Is, is that why this happens? Because it's tied wrong? I don't understand. Anyway, yeah, there's that. Here's a patent, purple patent leather uh, wrap bracelet with some colored bands on it. It's kind of cool, don't you think? 
One of those. Looks like it's never been worn. Here's another one of these. A rainbow. Rainbow bright. This one's a little scuffed. That's a shame. There were three of them, and two of them were kind of scuffy. So, that's a, that's a tragedy. Alright, there's two of these, and I want to show them at the same time. But I think it got buried. These guys, elements for making jewelry. There's a suede uh, fringe uh, tassel, yeah. And this, I think this is uh, red jasper. Yeah. And the other card has just the red jasper on it, so. But if somebody wants both of them, they could make earrings out of them. And I don't know what happened to the other one. It is buried in here somewhere. There it is. See what I mean? They're nice. Those go in there, and I know, I know, I think I know who wants those. These are blue. They look like lava almost, like they're dyed lava. Clay, I don't know. They're, um, Yeah, they're beads. Beady beads. Bead gallery. Hold on a moment. He's not sitting in there, so they're freaking out. Okay. Oh, here's a... <laughs> this is a, one of them rubber, rubber guys. Probably good for a pendant. Pendant. Oh, this is cute. Kind of, sort of. This is um, stretchy. Uh, gold tone, brass tone, dark silver tone, and this middle part has all of these charms on it, which I think is pretty neat for a stretchy. Look at that. And it's all different kinds of crosses, mostly, and some bling. Cute. That's different. Doo -dee -doo -dee -doo. Here's a very, very worn bracelet. Here is a snake skin a bracelet. And it looks to be the real deal. Snake skin leather. Cool. Here's a very crazy looking. Is that made of leather? I can't tell. No, I think it's... Mmm. I don't know. Rubber or plastic? I can't tell what it is. But it's purple and dangly. And it goes in there. Yes. Here's a navy blue and gold. Very tightly. Very tight stretch bracelet. Plastic. All of it. Plastic, plastic. But it's brand new. It's brand new. Here's a brass. Here's one with those brass end cap guys. Mm. Come on. Don't do this. There we go. See, these are brass. And then this wood. Brass and wood in fuchsia and red. Fuchsia. This is... Uh, Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras beads. They're different a little bit. They go upstairs on the bedpost with the rest of them.
This is a cute little glass bracelet with a spring ring clasp and what the heck there's a pearl is that a headband or a choker. I think it's a choker because it's, it hurts on the head. Choka choka. Here's a ribbony bracelet. Green. It's a little bit worn on the edge. Actually it's a lot worn on the edge. That could be redone with something different. Crafties. Oh look. <laughs> it's these guys with the with the with the with the thread. I don't have this color. I have uh, a whole bunch of other ones in different colors. I don't know why I, I I like them, but I hate them at the same time. They remind me of those Christmas ornaments you get at the Dollar Tree. Yup. Here is. Oh, what are you? You're all tangled up in there. Yikes. Oh, you don't get to watch me untangle stuff tonight because I have it facing the wrong way. Come on, undo. Undo, undo, undo. Undo e. Mm, now I'm hungry. I'd like I'd like to have some undo e. Undo e. Snossage. Okay. Why you do this to me? Don't do this no more. Undo. Undo, undo, undo. Okay, this one is a little thread bracelet with a, a wishbone. Ah! And a tag on it. Let's see what the tag says. I'm going to say Premiere because of the shape. Or Claire's. What's it says? I can't read it. Bella J. Bella J. Come on. Don't do this. It's just a little thread thing, and I'm trying to show you the tag on it. It's Bella J, whatever that is. It's one of these ones that's supposed to pull. Eh, alright. There's that. You're at 13. Come on. There we go. This is a little one of these. Isn't that pretty? Silver tone little guy. Whoop. Flip it around. Cute. Cutie cutie. Cutie patootie. This is... Bump. There's your bump. Black seed beads. And a cute little plumeria flower made of mother pearl. That's a cute one too. I like that they did the yellow in the middle. Or oh, wait a minute. Did they do the yellow in the middle or is that just missing? Well, Darn it, it's missing. I'm thinking there was a... Ooh, look! Look what I found on the table. That would probably work in there. Hold on. Oops! It jumped! Ready to go! Woohoo! <laughs> Come on now. Little blue one, what do you think? 
We could put a little blue one in there. That would be pretty. Whoop! <laughs> okay, maybe not. <laughs> I don't know where this blue one came from. It's been here for a bit. Here's another one of those. Like this one. Really, really worn. These guys tend to wear wear very quickly like that. Dallas to a jewelry. Here's a bunch of hashies in like a nude color and fuchsia with a couple of brass tone ones. It's got good stretch. Here's a broken strand of very lightweight, very inexpensive perlewellas. Okay. And then we're gonna oh we've got we've got a tangle look at the tangle okay that's not tangled much much oh okay that is tangled in there oh wait is that supposed to be there yes okay we have this little icon. I'm not sure. It's the Buddha. And it is hung with this guy. That's kind of cool. And it's on a white. White seed beads and two beads. So he's cool. Or she's cool. He's cool. I don't know if it's Kuan Yin or not. Could be Kuan Yin. It's too tiny for me to see which one it is. Here is a broken blue fused bead necklace. That can go into crafties. Here's a really nice unworn uh wrap bracelet. It's got rhinestones and then studs and then other studs. And it's very cool. I like it. Leather. I think it's real leather. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Ah! Mosquito! Get out of here. Don't you dare bite me. Well, if I knock the camera over smacking something, you'll know. That it, oop! Deep, see? Dang it. I think I'll be left the door open too long. I won't even have to smoke. Dang it. Don't bite me, you you terrible. And there she goes. Got it. Susan, you have to call that now. <laughs> Aw, this is cute. But it's got one that's not attached. The rest is. This is another wrap bracelet. The beads aren't falling off though, which is kind of strange. You'd think they would be. But they're not. They're not. Here's another cool, a lot of neat beaded stuff in here. This is really nice. Isn't that pretty? Here's another one. This one is a double, a double around your wrist. Yeah, yeah. Green and white. Nice work. Cool. This is a uh, plastic. Yep. I think it's faceted plastic, and then it's got these rough, they look almost like uh, lava rock beads, but they're screaming turquoise. I don't know that that's a thing. Little plastic stretchy hearts.
Jasmine watch band. Looks like it's got clay beads. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. <clears throat> Here's an interesting one. It's kind of asymmetrical. Let's get these guys out of here. This one is asymmetrical. And it's like cream colored pearls. Oh, that little. I don't like mosquitoes. I don't like them. If you get bit by a mosquito, the best way to kill the itch is you get a hot uh, wash rag and you run hot water on it as hot as you can stand and you slap it on there. And the heat kills the enzymes that make you itch. Fun fact. Here's some clay beads, hand done. Marbly, marbly, marbly. Cute. Here's a run of the mill purse. Silver tone bracelet. We have, eh, we're at 25 ish, so we got like five minutes. Eee! And I think we're going to have one more go at this box. Here's another one of those with smaller stripies. So those can go together. Those are cool. They're like, remind me of Beetlejuice for some reason. This one. Yep, yep, yep. Yes, indeed. This is a very small puka necklace. Are you real puka or are you cut shell puka? I believe they are the real deal. It's a little dainty one. Kind of cool. I like it. I should wear one of those. I never wear those. I have one this, and the thing is, I've got on this like, um, what do you call it? It's like a gauzy, cream-colored peasant top. It always looks good with puka. Hippie dippy, hippie dippy, hippie dippy. Here's a little mama bear. Ornament. Not jewelry, but... Let's see, who, who made it? Who, who's, who's responsible? Kurt S. Adler Incorporated, made in China. Don't know who that is. Here's a <coughs> excuse me, memory wire in tones of blue. Pretty, pretty. Ooh, look at this earring. Woohoo! Very cool. I hope we find the other one of those. Ew. Ew. We got eight more boxes to go through to find it. <laughs> this is an ankle bracelet with clear beads with black. Uh, it's got the black on the inside, black bore holes. And it's got a wooden thingy. I would think you would put the same kind of bead on the end, but that's just me. Little hempy, hemp and hempy. Oh, wait. This is the real deal. Look at the difference. You see how these are very much rounded? They're very round. And these are rough. Can you see the difference? And this is only partial. 
the rest is Heishi. And the Heishi beads are shell, it looks like. Man, my glare is so terrible. And my ring is backwards. <laughs> Here's a little red Strachi with Merry Christmas 2008. And then it's got a little uh what do we call it snowflake boy I can't think. So I would just take this bit off. And just leave it with the Oh look it's got a little candy cane too. That's cute. I would take off the two thousand eight. Here's the little Christmas mouse. He's probably a Hallmark. No, he's an Avon. Sweet. Isn't he cute? Little Avon mousey. He's a little mousey. <laughs> Here's a little child stretch bracelet. Really nice glass cubes, though. These are awesome. Cool, cool, cool. Here's some more neat glass. Glass? Plastic. Plastic. With these like threads running through. Look at it. They're like scribbly. And this one's neat too. They're cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at that thing. It is a pendant. It needs a it needs a something. It needs a bail. Here's a fun little earring. Granulated. Oof. Very, very bright. There we go. Granulated gold tone. Pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Ooh, look at this one. It's a thin shell with, uh, I don't know, is that embossed on there or dyed or applied? I think it's paper that's applied. That's a neat one. Oh, that's an earring. I'll have to look for the other one. I have to look for the other one. What is this? Something Chinese that says Baroque on it. It's a seed bead and thread bracelet. Apparently. Here's one of these guys. Says Believe on it. Does it work? Does it have working things on it? One side works and the other doesn't. Why does it always do that? Oh, there we go. This one actually works says believe so we can not be tossing that one here's a nice swirly plastic one swirly whirly oh look there's two of those I like when there's pears pears where's the other one here are pears okay let's put them both on those are cool they look really neat together. Always better in pairs. Here's a bubble bracelet. It has rainbows. You can't hardly see them, but they look like bubbles. And yeah, that's a little bit, a little bit wrecked. Here's a fun one. Plastic spikes. Matte and shiny. But they're plastic. They're the dress up kinds. Hmm. Here's a little nativity pin. We're at 30. I'm going to look at the back of this. I think it might be an Avon. Eh. 
Is you an Avon? Let me see. I don't see another mark on it anywhere. So, yeah. Well, I'm going to say goodnight here. Please leave a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment in the down there. If you see something you can't live without, please do leave a comment with the uh, timestamp of the item that you would like. Or you could send me an email uh, with that same information. My email is in my description. Remember that I love each and every one of you. And be yourself. Because everyone else is taken. Bye-bye.